So I used to do these top 10 hardest vocal lines to sing videos, impossible vocal lines to sing, vocal challenges. Well, today I'm doing something slightly different, but familiar. I'm going to do the top 10 hardest vocal lines to sing for men. Before we get into that, I'm going to talk about today's sponsor, which what better sponsor to have for this video than Harry's Quality Men's Grooming and Shave Supplies. I just got sent some supplies, and let me tell you something, this is the best shave of my life. See, I like Harry's products because they're made in their own factories in Germany. They don't outsource anything. They do it themselves, okay? Very fairly priced razors. High quality blades complete with a precision trimmer and flex hinge. The foaming shave gel won't irritate your skin. It's suitable for sensitive skin. It's not going to leave that kind of razor burn afterwards. It's just good stuff. So redeem your starter kit for just $5 when you go to harrys.com slash anthony. In your starter set, you'll get a five blade razor, weighted handle, a blade cover, and their foaming shave gel. Okay, well, now that I'm nice and fresh with these quality men's grooming products, how about we do the top 10 hardest vocal lines to sing for men? So here we have the top 10 most difficult songs for male singers by Ms. Mojo. Number 10, Take On Me, Aha. Uh -huh. It's all light. It's just light singing. I'll be... You'd make that switch right there. I'll be gone in a day or two. It's simple. In a day! Head voice is the easiest thing a male can do. But then again, I don't know. Maybe some people have difficulty with it. Number nine. Faithfully. But if someone thinks they can sing faithfully as well as Perry, well, maybe they should stop believing. <laughs> that was smart. Let me just find a quick faithfully karaoke. Here we go. Not the show. Wondering where I am lost without you. I'm for I guess it's just one of those songs that maybe it's difficult because it's, uh, you know, it requires feeling and uh, it's not always about hitting the notes. Number eight, You Raise Me Up, Josh Groban. Groban's vocal range is wide and trying to replicate it isn't easy. No, the way that you replicate it is you have somebody behind you grab you and shake you while you sing it, okay? You raise me, all you have to do is you raise me up so I can stand on mountains. Like, don't do the vibrato. Then you get somebody behind you go, like, shake you. Like, you raise me up so, you know, it's, it's really that easy. I don't know why they're making this a big thing. You raise me up. You raise me up. You raise me up. This guy looks like he's about to sell me a car. Number seven, All right. Crawling, Linkin Park. Chester Bennington was a phenomenal vocalist and gave Linkin Park one of the most unique sounds Damn of right. the 2000s. So insecure! So insecure! I actually have to agree about this song because it's, it is placed higher. It's not really that easy to belt in that range. Number six, Earth Song, Michael Jackson. If you think you can throw about on every a red song leather jacket Jackson. and a bedazzled white, but his vocal ability- <laughs> Five, Living on a Prayer, Bon Jovi. He can't even do it anymore, unfortunately. Most guys should <clears throat> probably just remember that it's all for fun, and it doesn't make a difference <laughs> if they make it or not. <laughs> you know what version of this song I like better? The version where it's just all the woes. You can find it on YouTube. I bet you can't sing this. Wow! 
<laughs> what the hell is going on? Number four, I believe in a thing called love. If you've never heard the song before, then as it begins, you might be wondering what it is that makes it so difficult. Yeah, what is it? But don't get cocky. Touching me, touching you, cause you touch yourself. It's that's interesting because it sounds like he's doing. There's there's a layer of vocals there. So there's and then a under it. I think that's why it sounds so robust. Any male singer who thought this is going to be easy starts to realize that most definitely is You're like oh, oh, oh no that was. <laughs> I got no. They start to realize right then and there. I'd smash. Three. Here we go. Of course. Aerosmith. Every time Steven Tyler looks in the mirror, he sees a man with an amazing singing voice. But for most any other male out. Yeah, Steven Tyler just goes in. He looks in the mirror and says. Man, baby. <laughs> That's the worst Steven Tyler impression ever. You got an amazing singing voice and some nice full lips. Let's do it again. <laughs> this is a very popular song, but Crazy by Aerosmith is another is another one of their songs I think is like more difficult at the end. I don't even think I can come close to hitting the note at the end of Crazy. Okay, that's okay. That's one thing, that's high enough, but then this, I don't get. <laughs> and the same holds true for another difficult Aerosmith track that deserves a mention on this list. I don't want to miss a thing. The same goes for another extremely popular Aerosmith song. I don't want to miss a thing. It's it's an easy song to sing. Are you kidding me? That's like his like lowest range song. The sweetest dream will never do. I still miss you, babe, and I don't wanna miss a thing. I don't wanna miss one smile. I just wanna go right now up on this asteroid now and save the whole fucking world. You're watching Armageddon and I'll send Ben Affleck my son-in-law to save the world. No! Bruce Willis! Bruce Willis! Ah! Number two, Unchained Melody, The Righteous Brothers. To sing it the original way this guy sang it, yes. It's difficult to, to replicate it. So slowly. Even Elvis Presley, who had a great voice and did a great version of the song, didn't try to hit the same high notes and pull off the same crescendos that Hatfield did so effortlessly. Well, that's also because he wasn't in the best place when he did this. Uh, I think like this was shortly, this might've been one of his last performances. This was shortly before he died. Uh, I, this is one of my favorite performances of the song, actually, Elvis doing the Unchained Melody. If, you, if you've never seen it, you should look it up. You know, there's a lot of great songs from that era that use that kind of like, uh, they used all different parts of their voice. The men, they would sing as, uh, as high as possible. Like in, uh, in the jungle, the mighty jungle. Push my Here are a few honorable mentions. I'll make love to you, boys to men. I'll to make this one, love you might to, have to you. Close your eyes and make a wish. Like you want me to. Go the distance, Michael Bolton. To go I the mean, distance anything, with this song, you need a great set of pipes. There should have been Michael Bolton should have been in this list like earlier on. All right. Well, um, overall, uh, I think it was an interesting list. Uh, it could be a lot better. Uh, I'll make a list of my own and I'll use your suggestions. Put in the comments right now what you think are the top 10 hardest vocal lines for men to sing. It could be any genre. Thank you so much for watching and thank you to Harry's Shave Supplies for sponsoring this video and making me look extra fresh on camera to really bring out my 
my mustache today. I mean, I needed it. And they made it possible. All right, everyone. Thank you so much for uh, supporting me by watching this video all the way to the end. That was really nice of you. Okay. Take care.